Take gas prices. Months ago, I saw oil production wasn't keeping up with the demand as the world started to get moving again, which could drive up prices at the expense of our consumers. That's why I work with international partners to coordinate the release of oil from our oil reserves and theirs. Now, gas prices are coming down more than 10 cents a gallon nationally. Gas prices in 21 states now are at their historic averages before the pandemic, historic averages. That's good news for Americans hitting the road this week. But beyond energy, we need to make sure that there's a robust competition across industries. Competing is what encourages companies to innovate, encourages them to invest, to build, and offer lower prices. I'm going to be convening my competition council earlier next year, after in January, to keep pushing for more bold action because healthy competition is a hallmark of healthy capitalism. Thirdly, I'm working to reduce the largest cost burdening households and budgets. And the biggest weapon, <clears throat> excuse me, in our arsenal is my Build Back Better Act, which will reduce what families have to pay for prescription drugs, for health care, for child care, and so much more. The bill is paid fully, fully paid for. It won't increase the deficit. And nobody making less than $400,000 a year will pay a penny more in federal taxes. Top economic forecasters from Wall Street firms reinforced just this week that failing to act on the Build Back Better plan will mean less economic growth this year. Let me say it again. Not a liberal think tank. Wall Street. Failing to make these investments is going to slow growth, not increase it. Look, if, uh, if we, in fact, seize this opportunity, I think we can lower costs for families getting more people working, and lower price pressures long term. And we're going to keep working on all these fronts because it is so clearly what American families need right now. I'm going to now turn this over. There's much more to say, but maybe I've already said too much. I want to have an interchange with you guys. But now I want to turn it over to Brian Deese uh, to begin this meeting. We'll move with I may have some questions, in fairness. <laughs> Great. Thank you, Mr. President. And we will uh, move immediately into the first section of progress made uh, and 